what is the most common question that people just totally botch in their analytics or Tableau interviews? I, I said the, the LOD, uh, the level of detail calculations. I think that's, that's a big one. They either, they either come in and are kind of wide eyed and have no, no idea or have never used them or, you know, say, Oh yeah, I remember we talked about that, but we never, uh, we never actually used them. And I think that's a lie. And anybody that <laughs> uses Tableau <laughs> for, for more than, than a week will, will know that they're already going to have to create some kind of. So can, can let's, let's unpack this. So for those, you know, who are, not in the know, what is an LOD calculation and why is it so important? Well, there is actually a fantastic course that one of your prior podcast uh, interviewer, interviewees has, Tyler Lubin, mm -hmm. has a fantastic course on understanding level of detail calculations. Wait, did he do uh, a whole course or just a YouTube video? Oh, it's a course and oh, wow. I recommend it to every single analyst that Shout out is to Tyler. at my current company. Yes, Tyler. 100% it is worth it is worth every every ounce of, of gold that it is so uh, level of detail calculations simply every data set has a level of detail if it's if it is orders it's every single order is a is a row and and that's the level of detail that the the data is based on where where you where you aggregate it depends on what you have in, in front of you so if you throw region on there it's aggregated to that region. So the level of details help you to go to go up and down based on that aggregation without actually having to throw that piece of data into the onto the table. So if you have region and you want to see the value for each, you know, the average for each order, then that's that's a that's a level of detail because you're asking for something else that's not on the screen. So I always say you're kind of you're kind of going outside of the table. So you want to you want to pluck like if I've got a row of of data that says I've got all my months in the sales for each month and I want to pluck April's April 2019's data off the off the screen that's essentially what you're doing with an with an LOD with a level of detail and so to have somebody explain that to me I think within all the interviews I've, I've had I think maybe one person significantly explained or sufficiently explained that concept to me like that um, again if you're interviewing go and watch watch Tyler's video take the course and and that will get you get you you know more more information than you'll ever need and it will help mm -hmm. you all throughout your tableau journey but it will also give you that that concept it will introduce you to the concept explain exactly what it does and then give you that talking knowledge that you can if somebody asks you what is an LOD you can give them that that information and, and explain to them right there. So I think that's, that's really, really critical. Uh, the other one, just watching, again, not having the, the Tableau public profile or mm -hmm. portfolio. Uh, it's not a question that they botch. It is a, it's just a deficiency in coming into an interview. Uh, again, the graphic designer would never come into an interview without, without his portfolio, his or her portfolio of, of work that they've, they've done. Um, even if it is, even if it is, uh, NDA, like we've talked about with data, just showing your, again, with Makeover Monday, everything on Tableau mm -hmm. Public, showing your capabilities, it's, it's bar none, the, the number one thing that, that people are not doing uh, or have not done, at least from what I've seen and, and what, what they can con continue to do to help them to, to stand out. So the two things to guarantee you get a Tableau job is make a Tableau Public with a LOD calculation and you're golden. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> no, we're, we're just kidding. It's not that simple, but um, <laughs> thank you so much, Christopher. This you just you're just a wealth of knowledge, and I and I love that you're so like open and willing to share your thoughts. Of course, yep. It's all, I'm I'm all about. I, I've said this from from the get go. I'm all about the community. I'm all about giving back uh, because that's literally how how I got to be where I'm at today. It does not occur in a vacuum. It does not occur. There's no such thing as Lone Ranger. Tableau developers or Tableau professionals or experts. Um, this exists in community. It cannot be done outside of community. So uh, with that, get involved in your local, local Tableau user group. Get involved in any analytics community you can, even if you have to start one in your town or at your company. Uh, th this, this, is not, this is not the field. If you want to be in a field where your head's down, you don't talk to anybody throughout the day, this is not the field for you. Uh, be, if you want to be in this industry, 
it does, it involves, it takes a village and it, 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 it exists in community and will survive through, through community. So. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for all you do. And I really appreciate your time today. Absolutely. Thank you.